everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another video. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Christy. I'm currently following the WW Blue program, but I do provide the points for all three programs on my channel. So this video is a little bit different. This video is going to show you how I make my popcorn in the microwave. So I've had so many people ask me, I've mentioned before that I have popcorn for a snack at night sometimes, and I've had so many people question me on how I make it. So I thought I would bring you along and show you the thing that I use to cook my popcorn in that I bought off of Amazon and I'll also show you what I put on my popcorn. So I do my popcorn in the microwave. I use Orville Redenbacher popcorn and I use this glass jar that I got from Amazon. This is just the single size. There is also a family size as well. So all I do is I weigh out the popcorn. So it's three points for blue and green. If you're on purple, of course, popcorn is zero. So it is three tablespoons is 40 grams on top. So all you do is measure out the 40 grams. All right, and then it just goes right in there. Now you can melt some, put some butter on here and let that melt in there while it's cooking. I don't do that because I don't want additional points. I am just gonna use some spray butter. So now I'm gonna put this in the microwave for, it usually takes between three and four minutes, usually about three and a half. When I can count to like four or five in between pops, then I take it out. And everybody always asks what I use on it. So of course I use the spray butter. And then I use two teaspoons of this white cheddar popcorn seasoning. You can have, have two teaspoons for zero points. So my whole popcorn snack will be three points. Zero for this, zero for the butter, three for the popcorn. All right, so now it's done. And that's how much it makes. So now I just put some spray butter on there. And two teaspoons of the powder. And actually, you know what? I only usually use one teaspoon. And that's it. All right, I wanna show y'all. So I'm gonna stick this clip in somewhere in the video. But since I filmed that video, I was washing my popcorn popper and smacked it against the side of my cabinet when I went to put it in the strainer and shattered it. So I replaced it and this time I got the family size one. So this is the three quart one. So in the other video I showed you I had the single one. So this is the bigger one. This is three quart and I think this is actually going to be great because this one you can still do a single serving, but usually when one of us, my husband or I, makes popcorn, the other one instantly wants it just because it's one of those things the smell makes you want some too. So this is gonna be great. We can make enough for the two of us in here. So I will link down in the description box, I will put direct links to both of them. I'll put the a direct link to the three quart size and also the 1.5 quart size. I was gonna order another small one just to have both, but I figured why, you can make, you can still do a single size in this one. So uh, I, mean, I don't know where I'm gonna stick this in, but I'll stick it in there somewhere. Okay, so I hope y'all enjoyed that video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you're new, I hope you'll subscribe to my channel. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. I'm Christy, and I'm planning us healthy.